guys, welcome to another episode of Gamer Logic. Now, while this isn't a full fledged episode, this is more of a shout out to another YouTube page that I think uh, you guys should really check out if you're into uh, Super NES and Genesis uh, accessories or retro games. Uh, and the site itself or the YouTube channel is called Xband411. And I'll go ahead and put a link in the actual description of this video. But uh, for those of you who don't know what X-Band is, X-Band was released for the Genesis and the Super Nintendo back in the 90s, and it was a modem. Um, you could actually take the X-Band modem, pop it in your system, take your game like Super Street Fighter 2, for example, plug that in, and uh, you would turn it on, and the X-Band would load up, and uh, for a certain amount of money a month, you could log on to the server through dial-up, and uh, you could play other people through the modem, which was awesome because uh, this thing, you know, kept your win-loss ratio. Um, you could send emails to people um, and just play other people either locally in your city or nationwide. And back in the 90s, at least for a console-based system, this was unheard of. Uh, PC gamers were doing it for quite a long time, but for a console, this was, you know, huge because Xbox obviously wasn't out. Um, PlayStation 2... All of those had modems and stuff like that, but this was the 90s, and Xbox and Genesis did not have anything like this, so this was really, really, really ahead of its time. And unfortunately, I don't think it lasted too long. Uh, I never got to play it on the Super Nintendo. I only got to play it on the Genesis, but it was fun playing these matches against people, you know, all over uh, the United States, and uh, it's a shame I never got a chance to pick one up, but it's one of those things that I kind of forgot about because I only messed with it once or twice, and then uh, I was, you know, on the uh, Racket Boy forums, and someone brought it up, and it just totally jogged my memory, uh, and one of the posters there is actually the person who runs the channel X-Band 411, so... Um, check it out. He's got all these great videos on there uh, featuring the music that the X-Band had on it, which really has some awesome music on there. Whoever the producer of the music was did a really awesome job. Uh, some demo footage and an example of the interface. It's just really, really cool. So again, I will go ahead and put the link on the show notes here, but the name of the channel is X-Band 411. Great videos. I really, really enjoy it. Thanks for the videos, man. So that's uh, it for this episode. And like I said, it's not really a full-featured episode. It's more of a shout-out. But uh, it's definitely something my subscribers should check out and go see what's up. So take it easy, guys. Gamer Logic.